I'll go on the record. Uh, now, understand, now this is my analysis based on the polling, strategy, and everything else combined. And it is a snapshot, okay? So this number will continue to fluctuate. This is not a thing that it's a prediction or it's writ write it in stone. But right now, I have Donald Trump at a 51% chance of winning the presidency of the United States of America. I hope that number changes. There's a lot of good reasons why it can change, hopefully should change. But right now as things stand, he's surging, he's changed all of his low almost all of his low some positions and Hillary Clinton's standing still. Attack. He's starting to attack you like crazy. I'm going to talk about an attack that they launched in the next segment. You've got a counterattack. Don't play defense. Counterattack. Okay, we'll find out. Look, there will be a moment, and it won't be that far from now, okay? Probably about two and a half months from now, right? That's way too specific. Two months, three months, four months, I don't know. But there will be a moment where I will have a sense, and again, they could scoff and they could do this or that, as to whether she's running her campaign the right way, whether it's aggressive enough, uh, et cetera, right? And God help us if it isn't. If she decides to play patty cakes or she goes in the wrong direction, she attacks on the wrong things, she plays too much defense, <laughs> then I'll have a real prediction for you guys. But right now, sitting here at, uh, you know, in the beginning of May, to have Donald uh, Trump at a 51% chance of winning the presidency, absolutely frightening. But what I'm trying to warn everybody, because they're, they're ostriches and they got their head in the sand and they don't realize how much the country hates the establishment. So they're sitting there going inconceivable, but I'm not sure you understand what that word means.